Shackathon is a fundraiser run by students to bring awareness to affordable housing in the Raleigh area. It started in 1998 and has since raised nearly half a million dollars for Habitat for Humanity of Wake County. This year, 1,500 students will fundraise in their shack 24-7 all week to reach the 2019 goal of $65,000. To tell us what Shackathon is like, we have a special guest. I'm here today with special guest Jack Elvin, who is in the College of Natural Resources and was on the build team for the CNR Shack. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. How did you get into Shackathon? So I found out about Shackathon because I'm on the CNR mailing list and someone sent out an email asking if anyone was interested to be involved with Shackathon. And I had heard about it from other students who had participated in previous years and they made it sound pretty fun. And I sort of like to build stuff, so I figured I would give Shackathon a chance and sign up. And I also love getting involved at NC State. Go Wolfpack. That's really interesting. How did the build go? Um, the build didn't go that great. Uh, we, we ran into a lot of problems. Not that many people signed up. And uh, it was just boiling all day. And we didn't really have that much water. Um, a few people passed out, actually which was like kind of intense. That's really interesting. Did you run into any problems? Our construction manager didn't seem very experienced with construction, so we ran into a lot of problems with that. Uh, he, he would tell us to cut something at a certain measurement, and we would do that, we would do as he said. And then we would uh, try to put it together, and it wouldn't fit, like the measurements were off. But like, it was really just kind of frustrating after being in the sun all day and just watching your shack have no walls while every other shack is like done and painted and looks great. Luckily, the shack did end up getting finished and it actually looked uh, really nice once it was finished. We've got the cute little panda in the front. The bamboo also looks great. That's really interesting. Did you stay in the shack at all during the week? Uh, I did not stay in the shack at all. I, I wanted to. I wanted to spend the night in it, but uh, apparently a lot of other people did too, so they signed up pretty quickly for that, and I uh, missed the sign up. So I'm kind of upset about that. Like, you know, if I spent all this time building it, I would have at least wanted to stay in it for a night, you know? That's really interesting. Will you do it again next year? I definitely would do Shackathon next year, but I would like for this current construction manager to do a better job. Everyone learns from their mistakes, and I'm sure this guy thought that he was going to do a good job. And uh, probably just, you know, he missed the execution a bit, which is all right. It happens to the best of us. It's a great learning opportunity and a great way to get involved in something good. All right, Jack, thank you very much. It's been a pleasure having you on this show. All right, thank you very much for having me. It's been a pleasure. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Uh, it's been great getting to tell you about Shackathon, and I hope you have a great night. Thank you for having me.